guys your anatomy is a little difficult to understand so just look at this 3d model you're able to see the pinna right and you're able to see the external uh, caustic meatus right that is the bony canal right and you can see the middle ear here you can see the tympanic membrane now look at this the tympanic membrane okay just look at the middle ear cavity look at the lateral how the malleus is holding the tympanic membrane you can see the lateral process of the malleus correct the way it is on the tympanic membrane and this is the manubrium of the malleus bone your ossicle right so you can see how behind the tympanic membrane you will have the lateral process and the manubrium of the malleus this is the anterior process of the malleus what you are seeing here is the tensor tympani muscle and this nerve this nerve is the tensor uh, the tympanic nerve it's a branch of the glossopharyngeal nerve you should be able to see the eustachian tube here right you are able to see the eustachian tube here now where do you think the other muscle here is the stapedius muscle look at this a very small muscle it refuses to get selected okay that is the stapedius muscle okay attached to the stapes bone the stapes bone itself is the foot plate of the stapes covers the oval window the nerve here behind the tympanic membrane can see the nerve here that is the corda tympani nerve okay there are some ligaments here anterior ligament of malleus and there's another ligament here lateral ligament of malleus so two muscles you saw you saw the tensor tympani muscle you saw the stapedius muscle and here there is one more muscle this is which one Levator veli palatini. Okay. So this nerve you have learnt. This nerve. That is the tympanic nerve, branch of glossopharyngeal nerve. And this one is the corda tympani nerve in the yellow. What is this huge nerve here? It's the facial nerve. To see how it is the facial nerve right so the facial nerve then this is the cochlea right behind it just see behind it posteriorly only you have the vestibular apparatus right see if this is the ear right so basically The semicircular canals are posterior to the cochlea. The one that is highlighted now is the anterior or the superior semicircular canal. Then that is the posterior semicircular canal. And this is the lateral semicircular canal. Three semicircular canals. So you know about the cochlea, right? Now look at this the nerves. One you know is already the facial nerve that you know. So what is this nerve coming from the cochlea? That is the cochlear nerve. From the vestibule you have the vestibular. So this is actually the ganglion that is highlighted now. Vestibio, vestibulo cochlear superior ganglion. Okay. So what else would you like to know here in the middle ear and the inner ear? Some kind of idea hope you got. So the lateral wall of the middle ear is what? It is the tympanic membrane. 
right? The lateral wall of the middle ear is the tympanic membrane. Anteriorly, you have the eustachian tube, etc. Posteriorly, you'll have the pyramid, right? So, from the pyramid comes the stapedius muscle. It is attached to there, right? Let's try to look at that. Right? The pyramid will be there from where the stapedius muscle is attached. Right? What else would you like to know, guys? Hope you have seen the incus. That is the incus anvil. So malleus, incus and stapes. You can see how they are together. Malleus, incus. These two together are the incus. And here you have the stapes. Okay, it is also called as stirrup bone. What else would you like to see here? So what is this? It's the nerve. So people hope you have understood the ear anatomy. Sometimes it becomes very difficult to understand the ear anatomy unless you have a 3D picture. So this is the pinna. Pinna you have no you know no. This is the helix. This is the triangular fossa. So this entire brown thing, right? The entire thing is actually the auricle or pinna, external ear, right? So this is called as a scaphoid fossa. This is anti-helix. So this is helix and they are saying this is anti-helix. This is the lobule where you put your ear ring. This is the concha. This is the crux helix. Okay. There's a muscle here. Which is this? Temporalis, temporalis muscle. Okay. What are these white things? Cart cartilage. Okay. I think for now this much is enough in terms of the anatomy. Look at some 3D diagrams if possible. They will be really helpful to understand ear anatomy. Okay. So signing off. See you in the next video guys. Bye bye.